I said, darling, you are all I want for sure Darling, you give me everything and more I said, darling, ooh, 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 yeah, girl You know I miss you Guys, I'm doing my wife's outfit of the day. So the dress is Woolworths, the bag Gucci, the shoe Zara, the watch Michael Kors, the specs Versace. <laughs> Let me <laughs> show. <laughs> so, so there's the complete look. Hi guys, so I'm going to be doing my husband's outfit of the day. He's looking nice. So his top and pants are from Zara. The shoes he bought them from Zara, ne? Yes. Yeah, I remembered. Yes. <laughs> Years ago, yeah, it's quite old shoes. Um, the shades are Ray-Benz uh, from his wife. <laughs> and yeah, that's his outfit. Yes, give us a twirl. Ooh, look lovely. You look handsome. There's a car coming. So fairly content to sun. Baby, let's go. What it took to make in you Like a blossom of a tree Or the color of a jewel So divine Is the feeling that I find Like a sweet mountain breeze And a fragment of my mind I said, darling You are all I want for sure Darling Give me everything and more I said, darling ooh, 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 yeah, girl You know I miss you In circles through my mind And it seems like every day Just gets better when you're mine When you love now and forever For my hurt you are the cure Like a spring you keep me healthy With a substance that is pure And I said darling, darling. Feeling rich although I'm poor I said darling in your arms I feel secure Darling, darling. Ooh, 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 yeah girl You know I miss you, baby You know I miss you Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. For those of you who don't know me, I'm Kuku's husband, Elvin Kana Nauska Rutiabu Chocho. So I'll be doing one episode of Vlogtober for my wife. It's called the Husband Takeover. So let's set a few ground rules before I continue guys. So number one, don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to like, don't forget to comment, don't forget to share, do all the things. Guys, we need to get to 100k subscribers by December. 
I'm setting a benchmark. December, I'm setting a target, guys. So in this vlog, I'll be doing a few stuff. Like in the previous vlog, you guys ask on the comment section, please ask your, hus your husband, Google, how to do paneling. So I've decided in this episode, I'll show you guys how to do paneling. It's quite very simple. Now I'll show you guys what you need to do the paneling behind me. So the first thing that you need, guys, it's very simple. It's like you can't do any DUI if you don't have this. Number one, this is a pencil. It's a marker, basically. Carpenter, every carpenter has this. If you do any carpentry, you're going to need this. Then you're going to need a measuring tape. A tape measure, this is what you need just to measure the sizes that you guys want. The third thing that you're gonna need is this. I'm sure you guys are asking yourself, what is this? This is just a straight measurer, a leveler basically. This is a leveler. It will tell you if your panel is skew or, or straight. This is what you need, a leveler. Let me just show you guys. Just put the items that I've done on the side. Then coming to the paneling, you're gonna need this a cutter. I call this a cutter. This helps you in cutting your panels. So it has different angles. It's 22. It's Five. So this just helps you to cut your panels. You need that. You can put this in. And this is also what you will be needing. This is the actual panel. This is the final product. This is what we're working towards. Too. So this is what you see at the back. The final product. This is the panel. You can get this at any build, building store, any hardware store. I got these at Builders. So let me not cover my face. So this is called the linear. They, dif they differ according to pattern. This pattern is called the linear. And they go for 80 bucks basically per 2.4 meter. This is what you need. And to attach that to the wall, you're going to need this. This is basically acrylic adhesive and filler. Just make sure you get the paintable one. So that will enable you to paint over the panel. This goes for 45 bucks. This is 80 bucks. The panel is 80 bucks for two meter. 2.4 meter panel. This is 45. This cutter set is 250. It comes as a cutter and a saw. Gonna need a gun. This gun it goes for 120. But all in all, the tools set us back like 100. No, 550, around 500, close to, let's say 600. So this, the glue tub fits into the gun, which enable you to just squeeze out the glue. Very convenient, I like this guys. It's not that messy as if you had a tub. Let's go, let's go get, do some paneling. Let's do some paneling. You made this work. I made his words We fell apart a thousand times A thousand times You moved away I'm here to stay I wish I could go back in time Back in time I'm so sorry That I hurt you so deep Swear I spent the last few years Just trying to change I'm on my knees And I'm begging you please Is there any chance you're thinking 
Hi guys, so like I promised you guys the last time that I'll show you guys the final complete look of the paneling around the frames. So this is the final look guys. It goes down there, down there. So we decided not to put a right hand block, just do one block on the left. There you go. Just let me know in the comment section what you think of the paneling around the frames. There we go. This is easy to do, guys. Yesterday I lost the battle Trying at a cost oh, To keep you, babe Oh, to keep you, babe So, like I told you earlier on that I'm coming to visit my brother, he's in prison, in Paul Drakenstein. So, I just got here, so I have an appointment for 10. So, I'm just going to rush in uh, and maybe, like, when you get here, guys, cell phones are not allowed. Uh, take cell phones, any electronic devices are not allowed. So, I'll leave my phone in the car. Once you check in, you get onto a shuttle. The, the jail is about maybe let's say two k's or three k's. I might be exaggerating, but it's maybe one k or two k away from the reception. So I'll take a shuttle to the reception. He's in maximum prison. He's been here the longest of time. Uh, that guy's my brother. Growing up, he's been in and out of jail. He had his issues as a kid but the biggest memory that i have of him let's start number one my brother is he's a legend uh, he's my hero i looked up to him like growing up 
but he had issues he's been in and out of jail i remember this one time as a kid me and my mom would go and visit visit him in jail that's the memories that i have of him like in and out of jail so now he's in maximum prison in trakenstein prison i don't know if you know trakenstein trakenstein is the prison i think mandela was before he was released he had a he was incarcerated here a few years maybe months or a few years i don't know the full story but he's if you can see at the back i don't know but i'll show you there's a statue of mandela at the back so i think he was incarcerated here before he was released so i'm gonna go in and i'll see you guys when i get out so there's the statue of mandela so this is the prison behind if you can see there is the statue of mandela Trakenstein. It's called Trakenstein Prison. They even have 27 for freedom flags outside. I so I'm back. Uh, I'm done with my visit. Uh, it was good seeing him, especially. after our mom's passing i haven't been here because i i visited him i came to visit him before my mom's passing and so this is the first time seeing him after my mom's passing it's been very difficult for him guys especially we buried our mom he couldn't attend the funeral so he's positive he's positive i know it must be difficult for him because it's difficult for me and i've had the opportunity to bury my mom so but the guy is positive he's positive he's talking about how he's gonna do positive stuff when he's out and i pray that he gets out guys i honestly pray because he has kids outside yes grandkids so let's 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 hope we get that opportunity before he leaves this earth to spend time with his grandkids his kids outside the confines of prison so let's go home guys uh, it's been a long drive coming here it's a long drive going back because this is on the outskirts of cape town it's like out of cape town it's pal is another town out of cape town so let me drive back guys see you
Thank you, baby. <laughs> guys welcome back to the channel so guys today is tuesday the, i think the last time i spoke to you guys was on sunday when i went to go visit my brother so uh, today is i just finished up woodwork uh, my last meeting was at three so i'm free for the day so tuesdays i work from home yeah like tuesdays i only go to the office wednesdays and thursdays that's that also depends how i feel if i'm if i sleep late and i'm tired i'll just tell them guys i'll, I'll work from home to work they're not that strict as long as you do your work uh, you meet your deadlines being in the office it's 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 not it's either there or there so i i worked from home today i'm sure you guys are <laughs> I'm sure you guys are still in the office, maybe. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding, guys. <laughs> There's nothing wrong, guys. Just work, work. So, uh, I've decided before I go out to run a few errands, I think we might go to Chinatown, Chinatown waterfront. Uh, let me do a tie on haul for you guys. Uh, I got a few stuff from. Uh, ooh, stuff is so far. Sorry, guys. Let me just. I got a few stuff at H&M, cotton on. So I'll just match and match, mix and match a few outfits and you guys will let me know in the comments and what you think about the outfits. So I'll, I'll do a tie on haul for you guys. Uh, so let me do that then. I'll just let me know in the comments, subscribe. I'll probably leave links or links in the description as to where but like i said you can get the items most of the items are from h m and cotton on so let me do the tie on haul then i'll then i'll see you guys later let me do that hi guys so this is the first look uh, the shirt is from h m the, the jean is from zara sneakers are from lacoste so if you can see there's the sneaker so just let me know what you think about the outfit this is the first look so this is the first look okay guys this is the second look so the shirt is from zara the jeans zara the sneaker from adidas i got this at sports scene so i'm just going to turn around and give you guys the full look just let me know which one is your favorite. I love these. I think they call them Pablo shirts. Falls under the Pablo shirt, but I'll show you a few Pablo shirts as well. So this, this is my favorite. This is my favorite of all the shirts I got. Okay guys, let me show you the third outfit. Okay guys, this is the fourth look. And uh, this shirt is from H&M, if I remember. The pants, the linen, these are all linen. The linen pants are from Mango. The shoes, Zara. Suede shoes, just very comfortable. I love these moccasins. So this is the fourth look, guys. Let me know which one is your favorite. Let me just do a small turn around. There we go. There we go. This is it's a nice summer shirt, not too hot. 
not too cold, perfect for the summer. This is one of the shirts that you need for the summer. So let me go on to look number five. Okay guys, this is look number five. As you can see, it's similar to look number four, but I just changed the shirt. This is a Pablo shirt. It's in now in summer. You can get it at H&M, Cotton On, Zara. But this one I got it at Cotton On and it goes for, I think 500 Rand if I'm not mistaken. As you can see, the Pablo shirt fits perfectly with any, with jeans, pants, as you can see. Let me just do a turn around. Just let me know which one is your favorite. <laughs> <laughs> so this is called the Pablo shirt. You can get it anywhere, guys. So let me move on to look number six. Okay, guys, this is look number six, the final look. This is, again, this is a Pablo shirt. You can get it in different styles, different designs and shapes, but this is in, guys. This is in summer. It fits well with jeans, pants, shorts, as you can see. Look number six. I decided to style it with shorts. So as you can see, this short is from H&M. The Pablo shirt is also from H&M. This is in the summer, guys. It's a must-have if you're a guy. Can't always wear football shirts, <laughs> so you need to style with this one this summer. So that's it, guys. Final look, look number six. So let me know in the comment section which one is your favorite, so you can get it. Anyway, H&M, Zara, and Cotton On. That's where you get all these outfits. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. I love this one. Ipoli. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> okay, guys, we have come to the end of the vlog. I hope you guys enjoyed the vlog. Please don't forget to subscribe, like, comment, give your views on the outfits that I showed you guys. Please help us get 200k guys. We are on 91,000. Please, please, please tell your friends, tell your colleagues, tell everyone, especially now that they're excited that the box have won the World Cup, tell them to subscribe. Thank you guys. Thank you guys for everything. Thank you for watching. Thank you. Thank you very much guys. So I'll see you. Hopefully I might get another slot next time and I'll do you guys a, a, a mini vlog. But so thank you very much for watching uh, I really appreciate it thank you from the bottom of our hearts see you guys next time I'm out cheers